Manzanar National Historic Site is another stop along California's Highway 395 that is well worth a visit. My opinion, if you have even the slightest interest in history, don't miss it. Manzanar is just west of the 395, north of Lone Pine and south of Independence, and the visitor center is free, yes, free. Years ago, back in the late 80s, I visited Manzanar, and it was simply a cemetery and the often photographed cemetery monument. In 1992, it was established as a National Historic Site. It is obvious a ton of work has gone into uncovering, recreating, and creating a very well put together visitor center, including barracks, community bathhouses, a walking tour, and a self-guided driving tour. So, what was Manzanar? It was officially called a relocation camp. In reality, it was a concentration camp. In 1942, the U.S. government rounded up and ordered over 100,000 men, women, and children of Japanese descent to grab what they could carry, to leave their homes, and leave their lives as they knew them behind, and place them in remote camps, military-style camps. Again, barracks, community-style bathrooms, and community-style showers. And the government kept them here for years. It was cold in the winter, it snowed, and it was hot in the summer, and it was dry and dusty. Babies were born, people died, they lost everything, and they had nothing. Three months after World War II ended, the camp was closed. The people of Manzanar had their freedom, but nothing else. Over 82,000 apology letters from the U.S. government were sent out to these people many years later, in the 1990s, 50 years later. The people of Manzanar made their own furniture, sewed their own clothes, and planted gardens. After this camp was closed, the government removed most of the structures and buried the gardens. The desert took over. Now artifacts, ruins, and the gardens' remains are being uncovered and restored. The barracks have recreations of what it must have looked like. The quotes on the displays in the center and scattered throughout the barracks are haunting. The sounds and the quiet also haunting. certainly a part of our country's history that is haunting. The Visitor Center is open from 9 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. during the winter months of November to March and from April to October from 9 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. and it's closed on Christmas. The outside areas are accessible from sunrise to sunset daily. If you have an hour or two while in this area, a visit to Manzanar is a must. The images, the quotes, and the feel will stay with you. So a little different from a campground, but hopefully this look at Manzanar National Historic Site was interesting to you. 
I know it was to us, and to us, leaving here, we had a different feel. The sights, the sounds, and the visions of what it must have been like affected us. And I'll leave you with some of these quotes from Manzanar's survivors.